Hey guys, welcome back. Lodurus here. Just uh, back in the town. I had to pick up some potions, took a little nap, took a little wander around. Uh, got some stuff to show you next episode that I've been working on. Figure I'll save it. This episode was all about... Oop. Oh wait, no, my portal's up here. Uh, I have picked up everything. Actually, one of the things I'm going to pick up, just to be on the safe side... Got a little food chest here. Look, they've changed the texture for mutton. I'm not sure how I feel about it. I kind of like the original version, but... As you can see, I've got lots of potions. We are going to go in to, to uh, go to town on that uh, that temple now. Oh, and also, I got around to adding the other layer to the beacon, so I now have, as you can see here, I've switched to speed and regeneration. I don't really need the regeneration, but I figure why not? It was better than strength. Because I'm not really going to be attacking or killing things in town. I was trying to get speed and haste, but you can't. Hi, buddy! Uh, one of the things that else I've been working on since uh, we last parted, I have made an entranceway down to the portal here, as you can see. Staircase down. Uh, I was initially going to do glass planes. Planes. Wow. Most fragile aircraft ever. No, uh, glass panes, but it looks a little... It looks fine here, but at the points where there's lava, it just... It looks goofy, because you get that wall of lava, and then this gap, and then the glass plane, and... I did it again, jeez. Don't know how to talk at all. So yeah, uh, I'm going to keep working on this. As I said, it's just a quick little shortcut. Uh, I've placed down half slabs so zombie pigmen don't spawn down here. I've also made it wide enough that I, if I have the crazy idea to take a horse through here, I can. Thinking ahead, what can I say? It's dangerous. Uh, if we come up here, you can see that this is where the old entranceway used to be. I'm going to fill this in just so it doesn't look as goofy. I also want to do more with this instead of it just being a box at the end. But we now have a proper connection to our little island home here. I've also been uh, just, not even strip mining, just removing everything I can from this area. I have an idea that's going to need a lot of cobble, and what better way than to just make a giant open gap underneath the tower? Makes sense, right? But I mean, other than that, I haven't been up to much with the... Uh, town or the the little tower here. I don't think I've made any big changes since we last met. Uh, I may have expanded a couple rows of wheat. I may have bred and slaughtered a few cows, but other than that, it's been uh, the same old, same old here. Oh, and I grew a giant tree. I guess that would be one giant. Oh, and I added soul sand. I'm a dirty liar, what can I say? So yeah, let's, uh, let's take this thing on today. Um... Yeah, I'm bringing up strength potions. We are just going to go in and decimate this place. No worries about anything. Just go in, crush it all. Should have brought healing potions. That would have been the smart thing to do. I'm also kind of curious how well this, or how much easier this is with Depth Strider. Oh, and I need, yeah, I need signs. Run. Go away. Go away. Go away. Let's put you here, you here, you here. Let's keep that that way. And let's go to town. I'm kind of curious what we'll find and what we'll get. Our main goal right now... I hear him. Where is he? The big guy's our main goal. If I remember correctly, there should be one near the top from the last time. Although I... It might be random where he's located. Hmm. There's no way up there either. This is a lot easier with Depth Strider, by the way. Oh, hi! What you up to? You're dead. Thanks for your stuff. If we come in here... Maybe he's down this way... Oh, yep, there he is. Get him! Get him! Nope, no mercy. Not even, not even giving you a chance to breathe, son. I am just coming in here to wreck you. That's one down. Let's eat. See if there's one up here. Nope, I guess that was the one that was up. Let's try it down. We'll see what's over. Nope, that's where the guy was. Hi! Yeah, I beat your big brother up. What you gonna do? You're just gonna suck it up. That's right. Down this way. Kinda wish... Oh, well, dead ends certainly do suck. Hmm. Let's see what's this way. Man, I still love the blocks in this building. I think they're amazing. And... 
Whoa, hey. Oh, that's outside. We don't want to go outside. That leads to the badness. You do not want to... Hi! There's got to be an... Oh, hi! Yeah, that's what I thought. Tried to beat me, but you couldn't. Because I'm awesome. And that's what I tell myself. Uh... Huh. Maybe there's... Nope, he's over there. I just got to figure out how to get to him. Nope. Okay, try again. Man, this place really is a maze. It's amazing. <laughs> Bad puns, I know. I'm sorry. Somebody has to make them. Uh, you will be my treasure. I just have to take care of the guys who make me not be able to get you. Um, what's over here? Well, this is kind of cool. I don't think we had a pillar like this in the last one. I like this. I hear him. Where could he be? Where could he be? Where could he be? Jeez. Uh, buddy. Whoa, -ho, we're not going to play with three of you. Nope. And no, there's a wall there. Well, that is... Blocked your line of sight. Ha ha ha. Yeah, now that you know how to beat these guys, they're kind of easy. I'm sure I have lots of room here. Hi! I'm killing you. And you! You're all adorable, and I want your shards. Don't hit me. Ow. You little... Yeah, you know what? When I had no depth striding, you guys were almost impossible to beat. Now? Now you're nothing. Oh, there he is. Oh, I lost that one. They're like little ping pong balls now. Oh, fine. Go away. Hey, ping pong ball. These guys do remind me. I may have mentioned this before, but they very much remind me of the... Uh... No! No! Oh, more sponge. Uh, the Beholder from uh, D&D. Kill him, kill him, kill him. So that's two. There's three last time. Will there be three this time, I wonder? I'll find out in a minute. When the mining fatigue wears off, I should get hit with it again. Hi! Yep, I'm a jerk. We are just going... I should have brought night vision potions. I just realized that. I'm really sorry if you guys can't see anything. That was my bad. But it's okay, because there isn't much left. Because, uh... Buddy's stuck in here. Ha ha ha, you're dead. So that's three. That should be the last of them. So the temple should be clear now of any big badness, which means we are free to loot it when the minute passes. You're a little one. Okay, good. What do we got? Ooh, good number of shards. Some crystals. Nope. I'm kind of sad there's no sponge room. But, I mean, we got some sponge. It's not too bad. Where are you? There you are. Don't hide in there. I can't get you. Get over here. Man, you guys are really maneuverable. Worst part is I don't want to drink milk right now because it'll remove any of the buffs I have, which means I can drown and won't deal as much damage. So let's... Hmm. Okay, guys. I'm lost. Uh... Hmm. This is where I was. Okay. Let's at least get back to the treasure room. I think I found the right way. You're outside. Yeah, I'm a total jerk, guys. I should have grabbed... Ugh, I should have grabbed a night potion. Completely slipped my mind, because you guys probably just see a lot of gray. And that's... Bad form on my part. Get over here. So let's just, let's just go over here, see what we have, and we got lots of guys. So one of the ideas I have involves a beacon, and I'm really happy they now work underwater, because I was really sad when they didn't, because it completely ruined my, you look like you were going belly up there, buddy. I don't think you're as fresh as you thought you were. Sweet, I can break blocks again. Uh, it's got a minute left. Should be okay. Uh, I hear the noise. Where are they? Oh, they're outside. I was freaking out there thinking like, oh my god, are they trying to kill me? Like, what's going on here? Here it is, our hard-earned treasure. Give me the gold. Give me the gold. 
Mine and I want it. Mine, mine, mine. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm gonna create little vacuums of water space. Oh, this is gonna be annoying to get around. Break my gold out. So I'm thinking we should try and get all the achievements. Because I think I'm close to getting all the achievements. Um, let me get this. I don't want to lose it. Anything else here? Good. Good. I also don't know what I'm going to do with this place. Oh, that was really lame. An entranceway that leads up to nothing. Um, let's see if there's any more entranceways here. I wanna, I, I'm want i curious if we have a sponge room or not. I'd really like to have one. But whether or not we get one is completely random, unfortunately. Oh, speak of the devils. There they are. So I s and that's my fist. Nope. 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 Fist is the best thing. Kind of annoying, but it's not too bad. I really hope this does turn out for you guys. I realize this uh, you know, this is the last the exploration will do. I'll go grab, uh, I'll finish getting this up. I'll go grab a night potion and I'll be back with you guys in just a sec. Because this is, this is unfair to you guys. You probably can't see a lot. And I'm probably going to suffocate in a minute. Give me a sec here. Uh... Come on. Oh, you're annoying. It's kind of cool, though, how it just keeps it where it is. Huh. Hmm. I guess it's not a instantly fill your air bubble gauge. You, you can still suffocate, I guess? 35 pieces of sponge. This is a good haul here. Um, ow. You jerk. Get over here. Don't you swim away from me. Yeah, so what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to cut here, and I will see you guys momentarily as I try and figure out how to get the heck out of here. Where is he? I saw him. Ah! All right. Back to you guys in a sec. And I'm back, guys. So I actually was smart and brought a potion of night fishing this time. hundred times better. Run. Right behind a tree. Keep forgetting they can get me. So I've dried out some sponge, I brought an oven with me, and I wanted to talk to you guys about the idea I have for this place. Yeah, that's a hundred times better for you guys. So, as you can see here in the temple, there's this central area that goes straight up. I want to build something above a temple. I'm going to put beacons here, I think. But it's it's... Because see, here's the thing. This is where I'm torn. I, I'm probably going to put four beacons, but I mean it... Oh, I'm full. Get out of here. There we go. Nobody loves you, Ink Sack. Um, I'll put some glass here, and I did not drink a water breathing potion. That was dumb of me. Hold on a sec. For those of you who don't know, an easy way to refill your air bubbles. Boop. Torch. You're better. Creates a temporary pocket of air before the uh, water blocks in the area fill it up. Um, but as I was saying, I want to create four beams going up and I'm going to build up in the air around it. Um, but it leaves me really torn because I don't want to do anything to the temple. I like it. But I will have to burrow straight the way down unless I build them up here. But, I mean, I, I would like full beacons, because, uh, for those of you who don't know, every layer in the beacon extends the radius of radius of effect for a beacon by 10 blocks, up to a maximum of 50 blocks. But, yeah, I... I, I don't know. We'll, we'll figure this out. Um, I just kind of wanted to see. I probably shouldn't have brought so much with me. I brought these signs just in case, but then I realized I had sponge. So that was kind of pointless. So... Uh, I hate wasting things. Uh, let's get out here. Let's 
see if we get attacked by any of our little friends. Uh, get a little vortex. Uh, island's over there. You look cute. You also look like you're about to die. Who's dead? You are. Oh, I want the stuff. I want the stuff. Actually, I just want the delicious XPs. Uh, room for the fish. Room for the XPs, though. Sweet. So, yeah, this is going to be one of the areas we come back to and build at. Definitely, I'm just not sure what I'm going to do with this temple is the problem. I kind of also wish it was built uh, built out of an odd number of blocks. It being even does make it quite annoying for certain ideas that I have, but what can I say? You can only do so much with what Mojang gives you. Oh, the spruce door icon changed. That's kind of cool, kind of neat. I wonder if any of the other door icons changed. So I guess they're reworking all the... The icons. How many times can I say icons? Icon, icon, icon? It just loses its meaning. You ever notice that with some words? The more you say them, the more meaningless they become. That is an actual thing. There's a word for it, because God knows the English language loves to name everything it can. But, ow, leave me alone. Go down here. So yeah, got room now. just want to see where this takes us. Why don't I pick you up? Because there's an ink sack in the way. Stupid ink sacks. Go here. Hmm. It's not too bad. I may rearrange the temple a little just so it doesn't look so weird and stand out so much. Laying on how often am I going to be in the temple? Mm, it comes over. Hey, buddy. Uh, oh, that's just gravel underneath. Okay. Okay, that's cool. I can handle this. Hi! You're dead. Didn't see me coming. Come on! Ah, took you out. So yeah, this will probably build as annoying as it will be. I think we'll build the beacons. We might actually build the beacons all the way down underneath. You jerk. You jerk! I'm trying to talk to people here of some things. No! I don't care if this is your home. I'm invading it and making it mine. Suck it up. Okay, this is a bad idea to come out of cover. Shoot. Really bad idea. I'm so sorry. Oh man, these guys are... You know, he might have left me alone if I left him alone, but I'm not going to take that chance. They're all jerks. Like this guy here, who's trying to shoot me in the butt. There we go. And this guy. Ugh. Anyway, as I was saying, I'll probably burrow down here. Um, and then just. Maybe. I don't know. Okay, I gotta get out of here, guys. I'm starting to get my butt kicked. Nope. 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 Anyway, I will probably do a lot of that off camera so you guys don't have to watch me fail. Although I may do it on camera just so you can see the hilarity of me failing. You leave those squids alone. Get over here. There we go. Anyway, so what I'm going to do, guys, I think I'm going to cut here. I'm going to think for a few minutes. Just give myself a second to think. And... Yeah. This is definitely going to be a long-term project up in the sky, not going to lie. But... In the meantime, it gives me a chance to figure out what I'm going to do for the rest of the episode. Because I think we still got, like, five to... Uh, eight to ten minutes left so I will see you guys shortly and we will have ourselves a good time for the remainder Ooh, I thought I was gonna hit the ground there oh man look at that that's terrible oh god do not drink a night vision potion and then go into the fog Wow all right anyway guys now that I've been distracted I'll see you guys in a sec welcome back guys I figured out what I'm gonna do for the rest of the episode um I decided we are actually gonna start the uh, that build out by the temple uh, one of the things we're going to have to do is kill another wither boss so I figured I'd do that with you guys on camera it should go a lot easier um, as you can see I have the effects of the beacon on right now but more importantly I have 64 arrows so unlike last time I'm totally not going to run out so let's drink our strength potion uh, regen is a constant effect going so smoke them if you got them Oh, now he runs. 
Well, that's just comforting. Come on, come on, come on. See, I've killer, cleared out most of the lava in the area, so I'm not too worried about him. Come here, come here, where are you? Oh, jeez, where the heck did you go? Okay, this was poorly thought out, turns out totally... I gotta stop doing this underground. He keeps... Oh, God, really? Come here, fuck, fuck. Now, I... No mercy. Oh, you jerk. I'm down here. I'm down here. Ugh. Well, this is certainly annoying. Doing this in a mine is not the best idea. Don't hit a lava pocket. I don't know what's over this way. Please don't, please don't, please don't. Will you just die? Now you're just annoying. Thank you. Ooh, iron. I like free iron. That went better than I thought. The gen beacon really does a good job of making this a lot easier. But I think I'm going to have to find a new spot to kill this guy, because, yeah. Come here, another star. Let's get rid of granite. Thank you. Boop! So yeah, we'll go make this a beacon. Uh, I have the hole pre-dug, so I will see you guys over there. In the meantime... Actually, you know what I realized? I don't think wither bosses give any XP. That's kind of goofy. Anyway, I will... Uh, See you guys back at the back at the little watchtower. Be back with you guys in just a sec. All right, guys, welcome back. This is the area I've cleared out, as you can see. It's a little hard because I drank a night vision potion, potion actually, so it's I keep forgetting how annoying that is. But what we're gonna do is just put in the two beacons to give us an idea of what things look like. And I gotta hmm three. Five, seven, nine. Yep, this is the right height. And so for beacons, those of you who don't know, to get the first layer of effect, you need a 3x3 three three line. Or a 3x3 three three pyramid. But you can actually share the block. So this here would do for one beacon. This here would do for a second, third, fourth, and so on and so forth. So you could theoretically make multiple beacons out of fewer and fewer blocks. There's the beams going up, and we can just put here and select speed, and we put one here and select haste, so now we mine faster. And if we just hurry up here, you can see what it looks like to get an idea of what I'm imagining. Hopefully the night vision potion will hold on just a little bit longer. Oh man, this is so terrible. I really gotta not do this. Mental note loaders never ever ever go into the uh, the bottom of the world with a night vision potion on. It is brutal. But yeah, cook pork chop. <laughs> I always love to wheel through my items. Anyway, as we come up here, you will see that the uh, the temple will look quite amazing. Just gotta get up here and boop. That looks really good, actually, with the night vision potion. But yeah, you can see here that the beams go right up into the sky. We'll be building up there, actually. Comes through the temple. I may, as we get a little closer underwater here, you can see the gap there through the temple. I might, I might find a colored stained glass that looks similar to the temple. My only reason to, for not doing it, and kind of what has me leaning against it is it will change the color of the beacons um, so if it's green it'll make it green if it's blue it'll make it blue and I don't I can, to be honest I just like the look of the regular beacon I'm not a fan of the colors and that's a night vision potion about to wear off so we'll see it without the potion see how it looks but yeah it's it's we'll see we'll experiment I might do some playing around in creatives to see if I can make a, a beam color similar to the prismarine I might like that, but I don't know. We'll we'll see what happens. Another squid died, but in the meantime, I think from our small little island here, I will oops <laughs> bid you adieu. Hope you guys had a good time. Hope you enjoyed. In the meantime, I'll see you again. Take care. Bye bye.